Hey, I'm Luther, and in this quick presentation, I'm going to walk you through an urgent problem that is causing every local business to face a major lawsuit over the next two years. Right now, local businesses around the country are offering $1,000 payments like the ones you see here to anyone who can help solve this issue with their website. This problem is so urgent that a small group of renegade consultants have been closing two to three deals per day, earning over $80,000 a month working from home. You see, last year there was a new law passed that requires every business's website to be accessible to people with disabilities, including blind, colorblind, and deaf users. This caught everyone off guard because almost no website has the accessibility features needed to be compliant with this new law. Hundreds of shady lawyers around the country have been taking advantage of this law, filing a wave of lawsuits against the unprotected businesses. Over 10,000 small businesses have been sued in 2019, and that number is expected to reach 100,000 by 2021. Small mom and pop businesses are being forced to pay between 20,000 and 200,000 in damages and settlements. In this presentation, you will learn to master the free software tools that add accessibility features to any website in a few clicks allowing you to collect $1,000 payments from the businesses who need it. Watch until the very end, and you'll also discover the little-known source of leads that are already looking for this solution, as well as the rejection-proof email strategy that I've been using to get a 40% response rate from business owners by offering a free compliance audit of their website. Listen. I promise this is unlike anything you have ever seen before, as this money-making method requires no Amazon stores, inventory, or buying from China, no traffic buying or SEO, no expensive software, and no sales presentations, meetings, or even phone calls since everything is done over email. In fact, this entire business requires no previous experience, and only basic computer skills are needed to get started. During a live stream of this training, a few of my Inner Circle members were able to learn this method and put it to the test. Here's what a few of them had to say. This training was a game changer. I immediately put it into action as you described and booked four clients each paying me $1,000 within a week. Be sure to check out the reply if you didn't get a chance to see the live presentation. Dropping in to recommend Luther's latest webinar, the software he goes over is so easy to use and clients will pay you a thousand bucks to install it on their site. It feels good to help these businesses get compliant, especially after everything that we've been through with COVID. Hi Luther, I wanted to report back with my results from the live training so you can use me as a testimonial. I've been sending sales emails for about two weeks now and have booked seven clients at $1,000 each and three more maybes that I think will pay me next week. Great training, and I highly recommend it to anyone that needs an easy way to land consulting clients. Now, legally, I must warn you that most people don't make any money as local consultants because the average person doesn't take the time to implement what they learn. However, the students who were lucky enough to watch this presentation and put what they learned into action have become local heroes in their community, saving businesses from lawsuits and earning thousands of dollars in fees for the work. By the end of this video, you will have everything you need to get started offering this service to local businesses near you. Yet before I walk you through the method, I need to tell you the crazy story on how I discovered this problem because it will give you a clear picture on how to make the most out of this opportunity. And after, I'll walk you through all the details to get started with this, as well as a few gotchas to avoid when starting out. Deal? You see, last year one of my longtime clients called me out of the blue begging me to make his website accessible to blind users. One of the restaurants down the block from him had recently settled a lawsuit for $73,000 because their website was not compliant with a new disability law and my client was terrified that his business was next. It was the first that I heard about these laws and yet a quick Google search turned up dozens of similar lawsuits in my area, each ending with the business owner having to settle the case for as much as $200,000. These lawsuits claim that the business's websites were not compliant with the Americans with Disabilities Act because they did not install accessibility features for blind, colorblind, and deaf users. The Americans with Disabilities Act is a law signed in 1993 to make businesses more accessible to people with disabilities. The law required businesses to install handicapped parking spaces, wheelchair ramps, accessible bathrooms, and other features on their property. 
Business owners faced hefty fines if they didn't install these features, and overall, this law helped a lot of people. In 2019, a blind man used this law to sue Domino's Pizza because he was not able to use a screen reader to order a pizza on their website. This went all the way to the Supreme Court, where Domino's tried to argue that disability laws do not apply to websites. The courts, however, sided with the blind man, and Domino's had to pay damages for not making their website accessible to the blind. The legal floodgates were now open. Disability laws apply to websites. Shady lawyers started having a field day because no website has these features installed. They could just open up the phone book to find businesses to sue and force a settlement. These lawsuits are growing fast and are all over the local news. Even Beyonce got sued over her website not being compliant with disability laws. Settlements have ranged from $20,000 to $200,000, with the average business having to come out of pocket $50,000 to settle these suits. Now, most of these accessibility website features are easy to add to any website. Features like automatic subtitles on videos for the deaf, high contrast button colors for the colorblind, and screen reader support for blind users. All of the required features can be added with a single WordPress plugin or one line of code to their website. The trick, as you'll learn in this video, is knowing which plugin to use and how to install them quickly. After some research, I found the best plugin to add these features and charged my client $1,000 to do the work for him. He was more than happy to pay. $1,000 is a small price for the peace of mind for avoiding an expensive and time-consuming lawsuit. That first paycheck opened my eyes to this opportunity, and I started to see if other businesses would pay me for the same features. A recent analysis of 10 million websites showed the vast majority of them, roughly 89%, do not have the features to be compliant with accessibility laws and are at a risk of being sued. Even more surprising is that there are only a handful of companies offering a solution for the business owner. These companies are charging $1,200 to $12,000 just for a site audit that will tell the business owner what needs to be added and then as much as $30,000 to rebuild their entire website with accessibility features built in. $30,000 is a small price to pay for big companies that stand to lose far more in settlement costs and public embarrassment of a disability lawsuit. However, it's a lot of money to ask of a small restaurant. This creates a massive opportunity, offering the only affordable solution to a problem shared by millions of small businesses by targeting the businesses that are the highest risk of a lawsuit. I've been getting a 40% response rate from business owners using a free site scan offer that you'll learn in a minute. This cold email is totally rejection proof, warning business owners about these lawsuits and offering help at no cost. Most replies are thankful for alerting them to the problem. A quick follow-up is all it takes to get them on the hook, paying $1,000 to implement the changes their website needs in order to be compliant with disability laws. This strategy has filled my inbox with more clients than I have been able to handle. Now before I walk you through the details of this strategy, it's critical you know the two things you must avoid when approaching business owners with this offer. Number one, you must not spam businesses with untargeted mass mailing. Only use this strategy on businesses that will be receptive to this offer and you'll learn how to find them in just a minute. Otherwise, your emails end up in the spam box and you run the risk of having your email blacklisted. Getting a 40% response rate is more about who you email rather than what you say. And number two, avoid selling businesses in the first email. Business owners get sales pitches every day and if it smells like a sales pitch, your email is getting deleted. My cold emails are informational about local lawsuits and offer value at no cost up front. This disarms the business owner because you are not selling anything. Doing a little work for them before you try to sell them establishes trust and rapport. Avoid spamming and avoid selling on the first email and you will see high responses with no rejection or complaints. Now, the sales strategy that I have been using to get a 40% response is stolen from the home security market. I learned this strategy directly. A few years back, there was a robbery down the street from my home that was all over the news. Three days after the robbery, there was a knock on my door. 
It was a sales rep from an alarm company who was coming by to tell me all the details about the robbery and offering to give me a quote on a new home security system. This system was guaranteed to protect my family and me, and he'd even give us a big old protected by security sign on our front lawn to scare away would-be robbery experts. I've now been paying for a home alarm system for the past three years, and what a brilliant sales funnel. Home security companies scour police reports for robberies and home invasions, then immediately send out direct mail packages and sales teams to canvas the neighborhood. They know that whenever there's a robbery, the neighbors are afraid of being the next victim. This is the same strategy that consultants are using to close two to three deals a day selling accessibility features to local businesses. You see, most lawyers tend to stick to one niche and location when they file website disability lawsuits. So if a restaurant in Tulsa, Oklahoma gets sued for not having a compliant website, surrounding restaurants have a good chance of being next on the list. By approaching these businesses right as the lawsuit hits the news, you are arriving in the business owner's inbox at the perfect time. Linking to news articles about the lawsuit hits close to home and pointing out that their business is likely to be the next commands their full undivided attention. Now here's the best part. Every disability lawsuit is listed on the government's ADA website. Check this website and you'll see dozens of lawsuits added every single day. A simple Google search turns up all the businesses in the same niche and area as these lawsuits. Literally hundreds of client leads every single day. The more lawsuits in the area and the more news reports you can find about the lawsuits, the better your results will be. A simple public service emailing explaining these lawsuits and warning them about the dangers of not having a compliant website is all it takes to get a fast response from the business owner. In the email, I offer a free site scan that will tell them everything their site is missing and gives them detailed instructions on how to make it compliant with accessibility laws. Scanning a website is easy and only takes five minutes with a free online tool. You enter the URL in their website and out pops a PDF report detailing every change they need to make to be compliant with disability laws. Sending them this report builds rapport and immediately establishes you as the expert. Now the business owner could just take this report and make all the changes themselves to have a compliant website. However, when I email them the report, I also offer to implement all the changes for them for $1,000. That's it. That's my whole sales pitch. Here's what's wrong. Here's how to fix it. I'll do the work for a thousand bucks. No hard selling, no pressure, just providing a service to business owners in advance to prove myself. This approach eliminates rejection and converts far better than any hard selling ever could. After all, business owners are happy to pay a thousand dollars to have this work done for them rather than figure it out for themselves. Plus, these businesses are looking down the barrel of an expensive lawsuit and need a solution fast. Spending $1,000 is a no-brainer to a smart business owner for peace of mind. Adding accessibility features to a website only requires installing a WordPress plugin. There are a few to choose from, and in most cases, the accessibility plugin recommended by WordPress is all you need. The cool part about this plugin is the demonstration mode. You could simulate what a website looks like to colorblind users so clients can see exactly what they are getting. For non-WordPress sites, I use an online tool that adds the feature in one line of code. With the right tools, you are ready to make any website accessible. Okay, that was a lot of info and I'm sure you could see why even rookies are making so much money from home with this strategy. And if you took careful notes, you could probably figure out how to do this yourself with some trial and error. However, why figure out how to do this on your own when I've already done all the hard work for you? And it's called the Local Compliance Cash Machine. The Local Compliance Cash Machine is a done-for-you marketing system for landing and servicing accessibility clients. This system will allow anyone with basic computer skills to earn money adding accessibility features to local businesses' websites all without any selling and without any coding or technical experience. The Compliance Cash Machine was created to help me expand my own business. I call it the McDonald's strategy.